Inspired Futures is a partnership in Macon County. We work to provide bright futures for the students of today and the workforce of tomorrow. At the heart of this work is career cruising. In the next few minutes, we'd like to take the opportunity to share with you more about career cruising and how you can be a part of it. For a long time, the Community Foundation has cared about education in this community mainly because we know it is a primary driver for success for both individuals and for the community as a whole. So finding a tool like Career Cruising to provide to our students and our employers as a way to connect the two um, is a wonderful um, opportunity to offer our students, our parents, families, and employers to make that connection. Career Cruising offers all of us the opportunity to connect connect with what's happening in our schools, what's happening in our workplace. And in the future, my dream would be that every student in Macon County would have a profile on career cruising and match up with the ideal job that would keep them in Decatur to raise their family and to make this a better community for everyone. And we're excited that Inspire Futures and Career Cruising is in our community to help organizations and business owners interact with the educational community to create good paths for success for everybody in Decatur and Macon County. We know that business owners and organizations have a limited amount of time available, and we know that to get involved with Career Cruising and Inspired Futures is a great way to positively impact your community with very little time commitment effort on the part of the business owner or the organization. So we encourage our business community to do that because it helps them achieve a workforce in the future and to start building those potential workers that their business is going to sorely need here uh, as we go down the road in Decatur. I think it's really important for students to realize what the possibilities are. Everything from careers in merchandising to careers in science and technology, uh, you know, it's just, it's really an eye-opening experience, I think, when you get to see what type of careers are actually available at a, at a you know, a global company like ADM. I, I think most students may not realize that we have a world-class research facility right here in, in Decatur. And we do everything from biotechnology to food applications. And, you know, those are the, the really interesting type of, of different career uh, tracks that people can take, and they're, they're right here in our backyard. We see a need over the next five years to fill several spots in our workforce, and we thought this was a unique opportunity to uh, bring together the worlds of education and business and really get our name out there as a marketing opportunity for us, but also uh, to allow students to get to know who we are and what we do um, while they're still at the high school level. Um, getting involved in a program like this will allow us to have groups in here for uh, potential tours, job shadows, uh, different kinds of things that uh, hopefully will allow us to find those students that uh, really have a passion for the type of work that we do and an interest in what we do and hopefully it will help us fill that need uh, over the next several years. Being able to take young people in and actually show them hands-on what careers are available, uh, what the job actually entails, showing them the day-to-day, -day, I think that helps young people not only guide them to the proper path, but also being a mentor is just that, somebody there that can support uh, our young people as they try to explore and grow and to figure out what career choices and paths they want to go down. So the Inspired Futures initiative came out of some partnerships that were taking place between community leaders, school leaders, and industry leaders, where we identified an issue where uh, we want students to be more aware of local career opportunities, and we want them to be exposed to these opportunities at an earlier age. Uh, so we took this idea and this need to the regional superintendents, and they were very supportive of the project. So we hope to develop a well-prepared workforce uh, that, that can stay here and be um, productive here locally in the future. Uh, it makes a teacher's uh, job much more easy. Uh, it enables our teachers then to really bring those resources into the classroom for our students and, and really help to give our students a, a better perspective of, of what careers are like and, and not only that but how they're applicable inside the classroom as well. Uh, so for us, for me as an administrator, uh, you know, the, the platform enables me then to look at what my students' interests are. Uh, look at how our curriculum meets those interests and then plan out 
how we might be able to better suit our students uh, as we go forward into the future. And so I think from an administrative standpoint, we see it as an opportunity for our students to, to go beyond the classroom, uh, to not only identify the things they might be interested in, uh, but also then to take that and back into the community and hopefully to build future businesses, future leaders uh, here countywide. I think uh, the nice facet about career cruising is when the students actually get the results of their interest inventory, uh, they're unaware of all the career fields that were available. Uh, Decatur is a pretty good example of it. We have a, a lot of different industries that are located here and within our internships that our students have come back and said, I never knew there were so many jobs that were out there. Um, unfortunately, I think kind of the old model of, you know, if you asked a student what they were going to go into, they would have said, I'm going to be a doctor, I'm going to be a lawyer, I'm going to be a fireman. There are so many careers that are out there and that's what's nice about this tool is as they go through there, it really opens up their mind on all the different possibilities. It's a one-stop shop. Students, once they go through the, the matchmaker and find some careers that they are really interested in, they can do all the research right there. Um, they don't have to Google, do other search engines. It's a one-stop shop. Um, I was recently working with a student looking in the, in the nursing field, and it had some interviews from nurses you know, at, at St. Mary's Hospital, as well as Decatur Memorial that talked about a day in the life of a labor and delivery nurse. And then another one was, you know, what's the pros and the cons? And just everything is right there. It's very real. The student can listen to it. There's other places they can read about. But it, it's a one-stop shop. And I have been using career cruising for many years in Decatur Public Schools. And it is one of the best programs that I have seen for careers for students at that grade level. Our goal is to get the students oriented to the career cruising program, how to navigate through the different screens, and to start thinking seriously about careers that they might be interested in. One thing that middle school students really like about career cruising is it is interactive and that they can go out to business websites from career cruising. So that interactiveness of career cruising is a very big benefit for middle school students. When they get to the high school, the stakes are a little bit higher and they need to start zeroing in on their careers and really thinking about the path that they're going to take. I would encourage any business to get involved in this. Uh, it's very simple. It doesn't take a whole lot of time. It's free to the business. If you would like to be a part of Inspired Futures, we would love to have you. Please join us and participate in career cruising and help us build Inspired Futures for the students of today, the workforce of tomorrow, and our community in the future.